This week, investors will get the latest gauge on how quickly prices are rising across the country. That report is due this Friday. CBS 2's Tom Wade is in Los Angeles with more on the surging fuel prices and what it means for summer travel. Millions of Americans are on the move for vacation, but they're facing packed airports, crowded cruises, and pricey hotel stays. For many, summer fun could be a real budget buster. Every time I have to fill up, it's like it hurts a little bit. For those taking a road trip, gas nationwide is averaging $4.84 a gallon. A year ago, it was just over $3. The gas is killing me. Rental cars, if you can find one, are more expensive than before the pandemic. Hotel prices are up 42% from a year ago, and airfares 45%. For flyers, it only adds to the frustration. When I came into LAX, it was terrible. The lines were too big. One reason for the long lines, staffing shortages. The four major U.S. airlines have 10 percent fewer workers than before the pandemic, but the hassles aren't stopping some passengers. We're doing a lot of traveling this summer. There is no relief in sight for California drivers, but in New York, drivers are enjoying a gas tax holiday through the end of the year. Tom Waite, CBS News, Los Angeles.